How did you make a career out of snowboarding? All right, <laughs> so that's the loaded question. So I'm a bit of a nerd. I studied math. I love getting into the tech of things. I saw a gap in the market with uh, product reviews as far as what I was looking for. Decided to try to fill that gap and just provide value to the community that I love. Thankfully, it's worked out. Super grateful. Uh, how did I get a job? I, I kind of hung out at my local snowboard shop. I did a lot of the competitions. I just, I applied for anything and everything that I was willing to do and wanted to do. Have fun, people see that, you make connections, you know, and if you let people know what your end goal is, this community is so stoked on helping people meet goals and get where they want, where if they see you put in the effort, they'll do what they can. So how are you yeah, building a career like, out of snowboarding? Like, I would like to edit um, some sort of snowboard magazine. Oh, wow. Yeah. What's your favorite magazine at the moment? Um, Slasher Torment. Sick, <laughs> awesome dude. Whenever I had any free time, I hung out at the mountain, I met all the people, and then I got to know everyone and I applied. And Well, once I did not want to go through the corporate life, I decided to uh, just go on that line. And I literally saw a Craigslist ad for summer snowboarding at Woodward Tahoe, dove right into it, never looked back, because yeah, now I'm in the summer in Timberline, and still getting after it. I, I I just kind of put all my eggs in one basket and I knew I loved snowboarding and I just was committed to it and I truly believe that if you love it and you have good intentions then something will come out of it. How did you make a career out of snowboarding? I tried to make my career as a professional snowboarder and I ended up breaking my back and just never made it as a pro but I kept the passion for snowboarding and I just didn't know what else to do with my life. So I just kept snowboarding, got into coaching and got into instructing and found a way to carve my own path in the snowboarding, some YouTube and Instagram stuff. Now I'm in a position where I get to snowboard and help as many people as possible, but I don't have to put my body on the line, but I still get hurt. I have a busted hip, so here we are. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, okay. Yeah. How did you make a career out of snowboarding? I made a career out of snowboarding by really just not listening to anybody, like their opinions on what their definition of success is, because my definition of success is just being happy and doing what I love, and this is what I love to do, and being with really good people and just snowboarding. <laughs> I worked part crew and I worked at a snowboard shop and I became a sponsored snowboarder. As far as career goes, my only career has really been coaching. So I got into coaching at Woodward Park City and a few other mountains in Utah. And I'm up at Mount Hood. I coached last summer and now I'm actually trampoline coaching and that's helped me get access to on snow and that's kind of the route I've taken and now I'm trying to get into videos and stuff. You just devote all of your free time to it and you'll get ingrained in the community and then it's just a matter of time. Sick man, that's it. Perfect. Thanks, Kathy. Dude, that was really good. Thank you. <laughs> Have you been like hitting any lines up here today? No, I haven't. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry. No, it's good. <laughs> All right. So this is... Have you done any lines? No, not yet. Yeah. <laughs> I hope to. 